Bang. Dear John D. Danish television has a new cartoon character, John Dillamond, who has a massive penis. Now, I know you're probably all laughing and giggling and being very immature, but actually there's nothing funny about having a massive penis, let me tell you that. And it does seem quite strange that a country that banned halal slaughter, a country that banned the burqa, would allow something like this on television, in a television show, that's aimed at children. Isn't that sexualizing young kids at a very early age? This character, John Dillamond, at one point saves children from a lion using only his penis. The closest that we ever got to that on UK television was Jim Will Fix It. But we didn't know what he was up to back then. Only the BBC and the establishment, I think, were suspicious. So it does seem strange that you've got this as a theme for a cartoon. But then again, are we unnecessarily sexualizing children? Are we making something sexual when it isn't or when it doesn't have to be? It's a strange one. Let me know what you think. I'd love to know what the right-wing reaction to this is. I'd love to know what the left-wing reaction is. I want to know if the snowflakes will all be justifying it and saying, yes, we want more of this. Denmark was also the country that enforced a ruling that meant applicants for the Danish citizenship were compelled to shake hands at the ceremony, even if it was with someone of the opposite gender, which uh, for some Muslims would have been objectionable. Now, I assume John Dillamond is already a Danish citizen, but if he wasn't, I wonder would he use his hand for the handshake or would he use something else? like he always seems to find an excuse to.